Hey, it's Robert here from robertcbrand.online. I hope you're having a splendiferous day wherever you are in the world today. Now, today's video is all about how to raise your vibration to attract money. Now, in this video, I'm gonna talk about why you need to get this handled, if you can't figure that out for yourself, um, what it's obviously gonna do for you and what you can avoid by getting this done. But also, if you hang around long enough, you're gonna find out how to get it done properly to really get the law of attraction on side and working for you instead of against you. And if all of that isn't enough for you, I'm also gonna point you in the direction of more resources if you wanna dig deeper and really accelerate your way forward with all things personal development and spiritual growth. Sound good? Ready to get started? All buckled up? Feeling confident? Let's go for it. Okay, now I know I've covered this stuff in previous videos, but universal laws all work on vibration. Everything in this universe of ours, everything in this physical world of ours that we see with our own two eyes, uh, in fact, that we perceive with all of our five senses, is fluid. It's, it's all vibration. None of it is solid. It appears so, but it isn't. Um, I'm going to dig into that in much more detail in another video. That's not for now. But if, if you can just suspend any disbelief you might be currently hanging on to right now and just hear me out, then what I'm gonna talk about is gonna make sense. And what's more is that if you can suspend that disbelief long enough to take some action, then you'll see the results show up, which will give you the evidence and give you the proof that this stuff actually works. And then hopefully you'll continue and you'll see the benefits in your life. Make sense? So essentially, if we, if we take uh, the point of, let's say, the nature of a positive thought and a negative thought. Now, again, I've mentioned this before, but I really want to hammer this home. A positive thought and a negative thought, they have a different nature when it comes to their vibratory wavelength. Now, universal spiritual law says that like attracts like. A positive thought will attract positive thinking. A negative thought will attract, attract negative thinking. They will attract things that have a similar vibratory nature to themselves. So if you go through life putting out positive energy, then you will bring more positive energy and circumstances, situations, opportunities into your life. If you do the opposite, stands to reason you're going to get the opposite stuff show up. OK, now for most of us who don't know this, um, most of the time, people operate on a default setting of kind of pretty negative, pretty low. They're looking at the faults in everything. They're looking for, for potential pit, pitfalls and, and holes in everything and everywhere they look. Now, the problem is that the law of attraction will see to it. The spiritual laws will see to it that more of that stuff shows up because that's what you're looking for. That's what you're putting out. That's what you're attracting. You know, they prove, they've proven this stuff with quantum physics. This is not just made up stuff. Like attracts like when it comes to universal law. So therefore, how do you raise your vibration? Purely and simply by starting to think and act in a more positive way. Simply that will raise your vibration and attract more good stuff to you. So what will getting this handle do for you? I guess it's pretty obvious, but let's go through it here. I mean, literally, if you feel like you're going through life right now, uh, struggling, and if you feel like everything you try to do in life sometimes feels as though, um, you know, it's pushing back, like you're, you're meeting resistance with every single thing that you're doing, then it, it means that you are not aligned. You're not attracting the right stuff to you in order for you to progress forward. It's, it's really going back to the old analogy about putting your canoe in the river and pointing it upstream and rowing for all your worth because you believe everything you want is upstream, when in reality everything you want actually lives downstream and all you really need to do is jump in your boat, pull the oars in, you don't need those, and let the flow take you. Life is exactly the same. All you need to do is buy into that concept, suspend the disbelief, and really, really start to take some action 
in the direction of thinking more positively, feeling happy. It's a feeling universe, right? How you feel puts vibration out into the universe and attracts like nature back, okay? So you need to get to a place where you feel good. So choose the people you hang out with, you know? Choose the places you go to. Choose the thoughts. Be conscious of what you're thinking all the time. And you will be raising your vibration. And the more you can raise your vibration, the more positive your vibration is, the more positive everything will be that comes back to you in your physical reality. It's as simple as that. And if you don't want the bad shit, sorry, if you don't want that stuff to show up in your life, then don't keep focusing on it. If you don't want it to show up, focus on what you do want to show up and you'll get that result. Okay, so here's today's prescription. Affirm. Start doing positive affirmations every day when you wake up in the morning and when you go to bed, before you go to bed at night. Okay, affirm what it is that you want to show up in your life and affirm it as if you've already got it. Visualize it in your mind's eye with your eyes shut to the point where you can almost see it as well as if you had your eyes open and you were gazing. At it in real life okay I say real life that's probably not the way to put it but you know what I mean in your physical world okay so you need to practice visualization you need to affirm but when you do this stuff don't just chuck the phrases out like they've got no meaning to them buy into it feel it see it attach emotion emotion is the catalyst that makes this stuff show up emotion is what raises that vibration and matches all the stuff that you want to bring into your into your reality. Makes sense? So affirm and then meditate. Meditate as well. Three times a day, 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes in the afternoon if you can get it, and 15 minutes before you go to bed. And really, really focus on being happy. Go in there, clear your thoughts, Focus on everything that you want to be, do and have in life and then get into your meditation, clear your mind and let the answers and the vibrations come to you that way. Really, really important that you do that stuff. Okay, so what you're actually doing is aligning yourself with the universal by doing that stuff. So everything that you start to do over a period of time like this will become indelibly imprinted on your subconscious. It will become who you are, not who you're trying to be. And as a result, your actions will be different and the results that show up will also be different. But you will attract people into your life, opportunities into your life that never existed before. Or if they were there, you, were, you weren't seeing them because you weren't aligned with that stuff. Okay, so it's very, very important. I always say this, the formula is be, do, have. You have to work on the be, you have to be, okay, before anything else will happen for you. And that being starts with you doing the work on yourself. So that when opportunity comes your life, uh, comes your way, sorry, or success comes your way, as Jim Rohn would have put it, it says, wow, what a great place to stay. That's what you need to do. So focus, in summary, focus on just being happy. Create your life so that every day fills you with joy and that you've got a smile on your face, you're feeling good and you're thinking positive thoughts. That will raise your vibration. That will see different things show up. And there'll be much more to your liking than possibly what's been showing up until now. All right, I hope that's been helpful and I hope you take some action as always. None of this stuff matters if you don't take some action. So take some action. If you want more details and you want to dig deeper, uh, then get over to robertcbrown.online. That's robertcbrown.online. Join my email list. Join my community. We've got loads and loads of people over there with you know like-minded individuals who are working on their personal growth and their spiritual growth and are committed to do in their part to make this world of ours a better place to live in. So if that's you, if that fits the bill for you, get on over there. We would be delighted to welcome you as part of the family. 
and uh, keep checking in here. I'm here every day doing my little bit, so it'd be lovely to have some company. Come along, check out my videos, make your comments, um, but above all, whatever you learn, if anything inspires you, just immediately act on that inspiration. Okay, while you feel inspired, take action. Because inspiration like that will fuel you to success. Okay, so here's to your happiness and your success. And until the next time, take care. Bye-bye. It's Robert here. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you've really, really enjoyed it. If you've enjoyed this, then please subscribe to this channel and come back and see many, many more. Doing these things all the time. And if you want to know when the next one comes up, click the little bell and you'll get a notification each and every time we've got a new video up there for you to have a look at. Um, and the other thing is, I nearly forgot. If you look, love everything to do with personal development, business development, and just getting yourself into a peak state, then you're going to want to get over to my free webinar training, which is going to show you exactly the steps to take to overcome any inner barriers that are stopping you from achieving in life and business right now, and exactly what to do to get that put right and start living the life of your dreams, starting right now. Sounds like a tall order? promise you, you can do this stuff. Get across to my webinar training. The link is in the uh, description below this video. I hope to see you there. And at the very least, I hope that you click the bell. I hope you subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you back here again soon.